Range was originally designed and built as a university project in second year, in fact in the end of second year, as a system for universities. We realized there was a problem with students getting the announcements from the school and so we decided that it would be easier if they could receive notifications within real time that they could interact with. We realized then, after a couple of months or so, that this idea that we had built and the system we had built could fall into several, several categories in life. So we decided that instead of it being just a university system, we'll make it an e-commerce slash marketing platform where students can get offers based on where they are and what they like and merchants can be able to show their products and their business to a new market segment as well as have purchasing and transaction happen within a moment. Currently we are under incubation at iLab under the IDEA Foundation. This is really good for us because you think you know how to start a company but the truth is you don't. Incubation has helped me realize when I am developing something that is for myself and not for people and it has also helped me realize that starting a business is more than just a, like an Instagram page or social media or this sort of thing that's so prominent among my, my, um, my peers. So they gave us training on how to handle our finances and our accounting books, training on how to figure out what exactly the customer wants because what happens with a lot of us, especially those of us who take IT courses, is we design a system, we fall in love with the product, but this product, this system, nobody needs it. I built it for me. In two to five years, we would like to have a series of merchants on the platform. We don't want it to be mall specific, like you'll just go to the hub and that's the only place you can use our platform. No, we want it to be across all malls and not just physical stores, but also online stores. So people or merchants who only run on Instagram would like to be able to host them and we'd, be able, and we'd love to be able to link them to students. My first set of advice is just go for it. The second is to be careful with how you carry yourself. You have to be aware that when you walk into a room, whoever is in there, and it's most likely going to be an older man, a traditional African older man, he's going to see you as his daughter. And you have to be ready to see that that is how you're going to be seen. And you have to be ready to present yourself in a professional manner so that you can change his mind and he can see you now as a businesswoman.